percentage calculator okay so before that i would like to wish you all a very merry christmas so um and in coming five days we have a new year also so i would um, wish all of you a great year ahead so moving on uh, to create a percentage calculator we have to get marks of um, stu like marks of subjects right so let's see uh, how to just create that in a very simple and easy way okay so i i would just like to style my screen first so let's let's rename this as percentage and let's give a background color first so i hope i'll go with go with um i hope i like this for today so yeah let's uh, change the vertical alignment as space around and then we have to add components now right so first i will just add a label component so let's re rename this label as um, percentage title label okay so text will be percentage calculator i would say 25 that's enough so black looks cool font weight let's turn it into bold i would also change the text style i think i would say cursive okay this is good so the next one would be right so let's add another um, text input box okay so let's get a text input and place it on the screen so for how many ever subjects you want you can add those many text input boxes okay i'm just showing you a easy way of doing this but this is not only the way of doing it okay so i always say this so this is one of the ways of doing this one okay so let me just style this english marks and this will be english text input so this is our first subject basically okay similarly you can just um, duplicate this and then you can rename this let's say coding text input let's take in coding marks okay let's duplicate let's say math so math and math marks right likewise you can add other subjects also right i'm just taking in 3 for today so out of 100 how many ever marks they are entering so based on that we'll calculate the percentage okay so we'll be needing a button right so i'll just drag a button and place it over here sorry so yeah right so this button let's rename this as um er calc percentage calculation button okay so calculate percentage and let's change background color i think i will choose a dark orange color better and let's choose the color as black text color text color black 
let's go down font bold font italic raised so i will just decrease this to 10 yeah this is better okay so yes um this is all for the percentage calculator we don't need much right we just need marks when you click on percentage i mean calculate percentage it should display the percentage value on the label so maybe i'll just add another label over here so let's get it over here don't get confused just go here so let's just change the label name as work label percentage label i mean so let's not give any text for now change the font size to 22 color can be black font weight can be bold so i would just go here then textile let's write times let's see how does that work and yeah if you want to give borders you can give i would give left padding and right padding and top padding will be two bottom padding will be two so that it has a um, it has some space within the container right so i just want that and yeah you can definitely give width and radius also so i think this is good i'm, I'm okay with this okay so let's just go to blocks and start coding for this so when percentage calculate button click right so basically you have to set the value on the perk label so percentage label set percentage label text to okay go to math get addition operator so you would be needing one more because we have three subjects right so this is how it is from where are we getting the subject marks is from english text input you will be getting english text inputs text okay so i'll just duplicate these blocks on the first one you can just add english text inputs text on the second one you would say coding text inputs text and on the third one we would say math text inputs text basically so from english text input he's getting english marks here coding marks here math marks here but this is not enough this, this will just only add the thing right now so not only adding is enough for calculating percentage right after adding you have to divide it with the total number of marks and multiply it with 100 okay or you can um, just put all of this into a variable right so i'm just initializing a variable called as sum here so sum which i will initialize till zero okay and now so go to variables and get set app variable sum to the sum whatever you're getting from this that will be set inside percentage sorry variable sum now okay so sum has the thing so you can multiply this sum with 100 and divide it with 300 okay so basically we need multiplication and we need division right so you can just place this multiplication within this one and you can just show it over here okay so app variable sum let's get this now sum should be multiplied by 100 divided by 300 okay so this is all whatever is the value calculated that will be shown on the percentage label so we don't want to directly show this right so instead we would just like to give the thing so i just want to display that this is the percentage value i i got so instead of hello let's write percentage colon space okay now you can show the value okay Let's click on live test to test this. 
yes english marks let's say 90 coding marks 90 math marks 90 okay calculate percentage yes 90 percent of course if all marks are 90 definitely you're gonna get 90 percent only so this is going well for now but let's also display percentage symbol so that it looks relevant right so i'm just dragging the item here click on this box to minimize it go to text okay get this one just give a space first and then attach the percentage thing okay that means we're joining percentage with the value with percentage symbol okay so let's get this again this time i would give 100 100 100 calculate 100 percent cool isn't it okay so this is all about our percentage calculator it was quite simple and very easy to create right likewise you can add all subjects also here right if you want you can um you can do uh, for how many ever subjects you want right so this is one of the ways of doing this and this is not only the way of doing it but i just i've just suggested you with the very simple way of doing it okay so this is all about our today's session guys i hope you all enjoyed this and you liked this so please do like comment share and subscribe to my channel folks hub i will be meeting you all in the next session thank you so much for watching this video bye bye everyone.